Lake Mead and Lake Powell are now so low that there is risk of falling into what is called dead pool, meaning reservoir levels are too low to pass water through the dam if Lake Mead were to reach dead pool. For example, no water would flow downstream past Hoover Dam, cutting off Colorado River water to anyone in Arizona or California for all or parts of the year, but there are major problems to avoid long before we reach dead pool. Particularly at Lake Powell, it involves a relatively higher lake level called Minimum Power Pool, which is the point where turbines at Glen Canyon Dam can no longer generate hydropower. The larger problem isn't necessarily the loss of power. It's that millions of acre feet of river water must then be funneled through four smaller pipes that are encased in concrete within the dam. Those pipes were not designed to handle this much water, particularly over time, which means that if any one of them is damaged, it can't be easily repaired, and that would radically slash the amount of water that can flow downstream to keep Lake Mead alive. That's why reclamation is requiring such quick and significant action. Trimming demand each year won't restore lake levels. Even if we luck out with a good runoff year or two, it simply provides a buffer to keep them from falling any lower.